The working principle of diesel engines was established in 1893 by inventor Rudolf Diesel. This animation describes the working principles of diesel engines in the context of an inline four engine that operates in a four stroke mode. This kind of engine has four cylinders mounted in a straight line. The camshafts operate the valves. In this animation, each cylinder has four valves, of which two are inlet valves and two are outlet valves. The fuel injection system is responsible for supplying the cylinders with fuel. The pistons are forced down during the combustion stroke. The force exerted on the piston is transmitted through the connecting rod to the gearbox. In an inline four engine, there is always one piston doing one of the four strokes. That is the reason why four-cylinder engines usually run more smoothly than their one- and two-cylinder counterparts. A four-stroke diesel engine has the same strokes as an auto-cycle engine. Induction stroke, compression stroke, power stroke, axle stroke. Unlike the typical auto-cycle engine, a diesel engine takes only in air through the intake valves during the first stroke. During the second stroke, the intake valves are closed and the air is compressed. As the air is highly compressed in the cylinder, the temperature of the air rises and reaches almost 1300 degrees Fahrenheit. In the third stroke, diesel fuel is injected directly into the cylinder. The fuel instantly ignites because of the high temperature of the air. The explosion pushes the piston down which transfers power to the crankshaft. The fourth stroke is the process where the spent fuel air mixture axes through the open exhaust valves and the stroke cycle is repeated again. A big advantage of diesel engines is that they typically deliver 25 to 30% better fuel economy than similarly performing gasoline engines.